I don't really like that ruffle thing around my stomach area. It kind of made me feel like I had an extra stomach that I didn't even ask for. So I didn't like that. Um, but you might like that. You might like that whole 3D, I got a stomach illusion. I don't know, but I didn't like it. Hi guys. So it is Karina Worldwide. And I told myself I was gonna try to hide my nails, but these are definitely my quarantine nails I'm struggling with right now. Nonetheless, the show must go on. All right, so this video is in partnership with Rotita. Rotita is a vibrant new uh, company based out of China, which is how we got connected, because you guys know I live in China, I live in China, but I'm not there right now, so doesn't even matter. However, um, they contacted me about uh, doing a try on haul for them and I was excited after viewing their website. I'll drop the link below in the description box for you guys. But they asked me to pick three items that I was interested in reviewing and trying on and I decided, hmm, we ain't gonna be stuck indoors forever and we might be out for the summertime. So why not do a post quarantine summer swimsuit try on haul? That, that's where I was at when I sent it to them. So I picked out three cute uh, bathing suits and I got it back super fast. So that's the first thing we wanna talk about before I get into the try on haul is shipping. One of the biggest issues I've heard from people who shop with companies who are in China is the shipping. So I sent them my swimsuit selections on April 1st. Keep that in mind, April 1st. The items were delivered to me April 7th. Seven days, that's not bad at all for a Chinese company. And if you want me to keep it real with y'all, which you know I will, I got some shipments still hanging out in the water somewhere or on a plane somewhere that I actually uh, purchased or were shipped to me way before Rotita reached out to me. So that is a pro. So when the package came in, I was just like, all right, time to try it on. Let's get it together. So you guys are going to get to see me in all of my vulnerable glory. So be very, very gentle with her because she is sensitive about the back fat and all of that good stuff. Also, their bathing suits and all of their clothes, they have so many cute items on their website. Everything is on sale, but if you like to save, how y'all know I like to save, use my discount code Karina R for an additional 10% off your order. So enough with the talking, let's get into this post-quarantine swimsuit edition. Try on haul. Usually I go by my measurements. Um, when I'm ordering from Chinese companies, I've become so accustomed to knowing to check my size in terms of measurements instead of US sizes. But the website did say it's according to US sizes. So I was just like, no, I'm gonna see if it really is like US sizes. So the first item we're gonna get to today, and I have my handy dandy notebook because it's a lot of information, is the navy blue one piece swimsuit, $27. The sizes go from small to 2XL. Let's start with just saying, this was cute. It helped me channel like my inner sailor, like just very, very cute. Um, I will say this is the only bathing suit that really fit me up top. So I was happy about that. I'm usually a 16 to 18, but I do know, like I said before, that this is a lot of weight up top. So I gotta make sure I keep it covered. Um, I love the frills. It is stretchy, of course, like most swimsuits. And I love the details. So this to me didn't look like a cheap bathing suit. And to be honest with you guys, you know I've become accustomed to cheap bathing suits because I only shop in China now. Um, but it has the cups inserted in. Um, it also has this elastic band for to keep everything in. The one thing I did not like about this bathing suit, and you'll see right here, is, and it's like normal bathing suits, they usually just become disconnected, but it just kept 
falling apart. It just kept doing that. And so I was just like, yeah, I would need to actually sew this in here to trap it because you don't want to be on the beach and you're just fully exposed, especially if you didn't ask for it. It just happens. So mm -mm, you don't want to do that to yourself. I feel like I could be on somebody's yacht in Dubai with this bathing suit on. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So the second one is the black bikini set. Comes in sizes small to 2XL, and it is $28. The model wore it perfectly, but I don't be getting hype when I see the models wearing the stuff because either it's Photoshopped on or it's a stock photo. So this ain't real life. <laughs> I need real life photos and real life reviews. I'm a 38 triple D, so I knew off the back, even if I got the biggest size, which I did the 2XL, it would fit me on the bottom, but probably wouldn't fit the top. So I went in knowing, child. I actually had to knot the back because my boobs probably would have slipped out the bottom. I love the neck piece. I think the neck piece would be better if they gave us an option to actually tighten it. It's no option, it's just a clasp and then you just tighten it that way. So we could actually lift it up a little bit. So that was that. Um, and then the bottom piece, I don't know if I'm a simpleton when it comes to bathing suits, clearly. When I was trying it on, I'm like, okay, so this belt goes here and then this goes here and then blah, 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 blah. And I was just so confused. So I just did what I could or tried to do what I could. And then I had to knot this too, because once again, I had to order the same size for the top and the bottom. So the top was a little bit um, smaller and the bottom was a little bit bigger because this is also a 2XL. Look at that. But it is cute. I think for a smaller person, it would be cuter. But another thing that I've learned to do with bathing suits that I really like is I just take my bathing suits to a tailor and sometimes I'll get old bras sewn into the, the bra part. So if you wanna do that, it's not more than like five to seven bucks. And this is a cute bathing suit, so why not? Felt very like, oh, this is me-ish. Is it as cute as the blue one? Not even, but it is cute if you have the body for it or if you get it tailored. I think it has potential. So let's get into bathing suit number three. This is the last bathing suit. I like this one, but once again, it's similar to the black bikini top. Um, it just doesn't cover me the way she needs to be covered. Um, but this one is called the Sunflower Print Bikini Set. I ordered it in a double XL, like I ordered the other bathing suits. The sizes are from medium to 2XL, and it's $28. But once again, $28 means nothing to you because you have that discount code, Karina R. All right, so the one thing I, I noticed when I first put the bikini bottom on is the ruffles in the front. It looks like that on the model too, but I guess it just looked different on her, or I didn't really pay attention to it until I got it. And I don't really like that ruffle thing around my stomach area. It kind of made me feel like I had an extra stomach that I didn't even ask for. So I didn't like that. Um, but you might like that. You might like that whole 3D, I got a stomach illusion. I don't know, but I didn't like it. Or maybe you don't have a stomach, so you don't even have to worry about that. But yeah, that was a no for me. But I love the pattern and I love sunflowers. Sunflowers just, just scream summer and sun, hence sunflower. The top, it has two bands in the back. I'm gonna show you, I'm trying to deal with it right now before I show you guys. It has two bands in the back. One is just a regular band and then the other one has a clasp. The issue with this one is, it. I prefer, when it comes to halter top bikinis, I prefer two straps. The one that straps in the back and then the one that straps around the neck because I can actually control how tight it is and then I can give myself more support. So I didn't have any support here. Um, I had some support up top, but as you can see, when you look at the, uh, the close up of the bikini top, you'll see that most of my boob was all on the sides, child, underneath. Most of it wasn't even in the cup. So 
that was my challenge again but i do like the the halter top that allows you to tie it yourself because then you're able to manage you know not just cleavage but also the support and i don't know if i'm the only person that does this but sometimes i tie it so tight because i like for them to sit up i tie it so tight sometimes i give myself a headache but that's okay all in the name of love and fashion but yeah number three was okay it was just like the ruffles weren't for me and the cups actually i wonder if it'd be great if companies could just let us buy separates like you buy the top and there's actually companies out there like that so it's not like i'm creating something new they've been out there so i was just making another suggestion all right guys so that is the end of my try on haul for rotita post quarantine swimsuit edition I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Once again, the link is below for Rotita. You have my discount code for an additional 10% off. All right, bye. To stay updated on what's going on in Karina's world, please click the subscribe button. Don't forget to like and share. Ciao.